What is up guys? Welcome back to another video and today we are back in my Minecraft hardcore world. It's been a while since I've been here, but there's one new thing that is about to happen. Boom, that's right, we finally got shaders. So now we can actually play with shaders in 1.16. So this is pretty awesome. Yeah, honestly, um, playing 1.16 after 1.15 with my shaders, it just looks really weird without any shaders. So now we're finally back to normal, so I'm really happy about this. Okay, this like one minute of footage got corrupted. It's not really a big deal, but it's pretty much just me catching a fish for the very first time and then saying like, oh wow, we're 160 days in this series, and this is the first time we catch a fish. Okay, let's see, I fished like a little bit, like probably like a minute or something. I got one puffer fish, three salmon, and yeah, that's about it. Let's see if we can tame these cats. Where did these cats go? I remember seeing one somewhere. It was somewhere in here. Oh, there's one right there, okay. I think you can use raw fish, right? Why is he running for me? Come back. Yo, chill. Yo, 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 chill, chill, chill. Are they scared of me? I'm so confused. Wait, did that work? Do I have a cat? It showed, it showed hearts. Yo, there we go. We got our very first cat. This is so sick. Wait, does it follow me? The cat follows me. Okay, bet. Now we have a cat and a dog. So the reason why I want these cats is because I want to build a creeper farm in this episode. Because we're really going to need some rockets for like a lot of things. Like rockets are going to be really important in the future. So we're going to need a creeper farm. And I'm going to be, able to be building a really simple design. And I just need some cats for it. Just like one or two cats. So that's why I need this. Alrighty, a bit of fishing and cat hunting later. I should be able to get this second cat right here. Come on. Stop running away from me. Yo, I'm just trying to give you a fit. Oh, there we go. I hate chasing these things around. They're actually annoying. Okay, it's turning dark. There's a creeper right there. Um, I'm gonna bring this cat and let it sit down right here so I can have a little cat collection over here. Alright, I uh, excavated like a little area right here um, that was like full of trees. And it's on the mountain that's to like the left of our house if we're looking this way. So like this is the left, I guess. Um, I think it's a pretty nice space to build this creeper farm. It's a pretty small, simple creeper farm. And I will put a picture up on the screen right now of what video we are using. I'm trying to look down at my phone right now because my phone has the, the layout that I need to build this in. And it's a pretty simple 1.16 creeper farm. So, like, if you guys want to build this yourself, I'll link it down in the description. I'm going to get started building this thing. Okay, I changed my mind. I'm going to excavate this down a little bit deeper just so I have more of, like, a flat surface to work on. Now sit back and relax and enjoy a little time lapse of me building the creeper farm. Alright, now that I finished up building the creeper farm, it's time for me to build my AFK spot. Since I don't have any bamboo or scaffolding right now, I'm gonna have to use dirt. So I gotta build this up to Y level 200, because it has to be 123 blocks above the farm. Alright, now that I'm up here in my AFK spot, I'm just gonna build a little room for me to AFK in so that the phantoms don't kill me at night. And it's just gonna be super small, just a 2x1x2, two by by, two by by two. yeah, that's how long it, that's how big it is. Alright, and then I don't have a door, so I'm just gonna be using this for a door. I think that works. Yeah, I don't think anyone can get me in here like that. And I can also get in and out. 
So now let's just drop back down. Oh shoot, okay, I'm going so fast. I don't know if my elytra was working or not. And I'm pretty sure that's the creeper farm done right there. Let's see if we can hear any creepers dying. Yep, there we go. You can hear all the creepers dying down there. This sounds like a lot. So I think I'm going to AFK for like an hour or so and just see how much gunpowder this farm makes and if it's efficient or not. Okay, I've been AFKing for about an hour. Let's check how much gunpowder we have. I built like a little stair- Oh, don't take fall damage. I can all hear him dying in there. I built a little stairway down so we can go check on this. Dang, that's a lot of gunpowder. This was only for like an hour-ish of time. And still coming in. Yeah, this is this is going to be a really nice farm for us. I'm going to take like three stacks of that just for now. Um, and bring them home. So now pretty much all we need is just an automatic sugarcane farm. And then if we have that, we're going to be completely set for rockets for life pretty much. Because that is producing super fast. Right, let me just check how much sugar... Oh wait, I forgot we moved our storage. <laughs> that was in the last episode. Let's see how much sugarcane we have. Uh... That's not the chest. Ooh, we have a good amount. Like, f actually, that's, that's, that's more than a good amount. Like, five or stacks. I'm just gonna make a bunch of rockets so we'll pretty much be chilling. There we go. We have a lot of rockets now. I'm gonna dump these back in there because we don't need them. And I'll put that gunpowder in there. All right, there we go. I think we are good on rockets now. So that is the goal of this episode completed. I guess I'll make an automatic sugarcane farm as well because all I need is really an observer that I don't have right now and I think you just need like nether quartz to make that so it should be pretty simple. Alright so to make a farm I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need hoppers, observers, um observers I don't know how to craft them. Alright I think I'm gonna need, I'm just gonna do three for now. Three observers, I don't exactly know how much I'm gonna need, uh I think I'm gonna need three pistons as well. Let's make those pistons. What else do I need here? Oh, hoppers. Oh, I need chests. Yeah, I need chests. Do we have chests? We have 17 chests. I don't know where that came from. I'll just make two hoppers. And what else do I need? I don't really know. I think maybe glass for the outside. That might just be it. And then like one piece of sugar cane. Alright, if I'm missing anything, I'm just gonna come back here and try to figure it out. Okay, I'm actually just gonna build the sugar cane farm right here next to my beacon. So I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be needing a hole for the water back here. Don't exactly remember how to make one of these. I'll figure it out though. Sugar cane goes there and then the piston goes here. Right above the piston goes in observer facing this way. Right? That should work. Wait, one more thing. Actually, I need to put a redstone piece right there. Then I can just... Yeah, there we go. So now if our sugar cane grows up, it should harvest it. So I can just make like a harvesting thing right here and we should be good to go. All right, so now I'm pretty much done with my basic design and it's super simple. Like all I added was just like a little minecart with a hopper underneath this. So then when it pushes it out, it can actually collect the sugar cane and put it inside of that chest. So yeah, now we have a really small automatic sugar cane going on and I'm definitely gonna be expanding this later in the future. I'm just kind of too lazy to do it right now. If we ever need mass sugarcane production, I know exactly what to do because I left a bunch of open spaces here where I can just, just extend this thing out. Okay, I actually decided to put mending on my leggings because I realized they're not even that bad. They have protection for an unbreaking three. So like, I might as well just put mending on them. So we got a mending book right here and I think we need an anvil for this. So I might have, yeah, there, I have one right here. Let's see how much this will cost. I should have enough. Oh, it's only two. Okay, that's good. So now I just have to... Heal that back up to full and we should be good to go. All right, so one thing I wanna start doing is shouting you guys out in every single episode because you guys show tons of amazing support. So pretty much to have a chance to be in the next video, just comment down below and I'll be picking a comment from the previous video to be in the new one. So this video's shout out will go to Vox YouTube. Thank you so much for the comment. I will put up a sign, I'll put it up here for now. This will be the very first one. Okay, there we go, and that is the first shout out done. So just comment down in this video and you might have a chance to be in the very next episode. I think they'll wrap it up for this video and I will have tons of more Minecraft videos coming out soon. So just stay tuned and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.